so I'm coming to you live from my parking deck at school <laughs> I just had to jump on and do a video real quick because today was one of those days where I was like so in my feelings that I'm gonna be honest I didn't want to be at school today like I wanted to sleep in I snoozed my alarm at least four or five times and I told myself okay why can't you just stay at home today why can't you just sleep in and maybe study at home and then you know I thought about it and I said well hmm I have an 11 year old here who's gonna probably be on Fortnite half of the day and I have a baby under six months so what's the likelihood of me actually being productive today if I stay at home and not stick to my regular routine but majority of my body was saying no don't go <laughs> And then the realistic part of me was saying, get up, get up. You're going to have so many days where you don't want to do anything, where you don't want to go, where you don't want to go here, you don't want to go there, but you're going to have to. And today's one of those days where you have a goal and you need to work towards that goal and being at home is not going to help you get closer to that goal. So my main point of kind of being on this little video is to say that there are going to be so many days when you question why you're doing what you're doing. When you question like why are you pursuing medicine or why are you pursuing law school or why are you pursuing whatever you're deciding to pursue. There are going to be so many days that pop up like this where you just realize that there could be so many easier routes that you can take instead of taking the long hard road of wherever you're going. But when you come to those days, you really have to do some deep self-reflection so that you're not distracted or deterred from where you're supposed to be going. Because there's going to be so many people, so many things, so many situations that are put in our lives to distract us, to get us off the path of where we're supposed to go, get us off the path of the right things that we're supposed to do. But for you, you have to stay focused. And this morning, I really had to think about, like, while I'm tired, while I'm sleep deprived, while I wish I could be enjoying summer, I have a goal that I want to meet. I have people who are, you know, cheering for me and wanting me to meet that goal. But really, it's not about those people. It's about me. It's about inside of me. I know that if I don't meet this goal or if I don't accomplish this dream, I'm going to be always looking back at what could have would have should have been like had I you know stayed clear on my route had I not deterred had I not you know wanted to give up and actually gave in to that desire to give up so I want to tell you today that no matter what you're going through no matter what you want to do no matter what you feel like you can't or can't do you can do it um on those days when you're feeling drained just know that at the end of the rainbow there's always a pot of gold metaphorically even um but I really had to think about the fact that no matter how many people are pushing for me to meet this goal no matter how many people are pushing for me to become a physician to finish medical school to achieve my dreams if I am not pushing for myself if or if I'm not dedicated to this mission of becoming a physician 10 times 20 times more than what other people who are for me then I'm never gonna get there so on those days again when you are drained you know take a moment to breathe take a moment to you know soak in the sadness or the anger or whatever emotion you're feeling and then get up and get to it so as i say that i'm going to get out of my car <laughs> i'm going to go to my study room and i'm going to put in a full day's work of studying so that i can achieve the goal that i want and be one step closer to where i want to be so again um and I'm going to leave you with this. I'm not the type of person who believes one size fits all. I'm not going to sit here and tell you that, you know, or give a scenario where this person did X, Y, and Z. So why can't you do X, Y, and Z? No, that's, that's not my motto. And I hate when people try to use those examples to push you and motivate you to do something. No. What I'm going to say is because somebody else has achieved a goal you want to does not mean that's how your path is going to be embrace whatever your path is know that you don't know have to do it like the next person but you do have to do it that's true and congruent to yourself so if that means it takes you a little longer to get there that means you took you know a detour that was all the way around the corner and back again when they just took a straight shot it's okay your your path is your path and your destiny is your destiny no matter how long or how far you know 
your route may take you, you will get there. So never compare yourself to the next person. So again, that was my last little motivation for Friday. Go into the weekend and you know keep working towards your goals.